Hey guys, I'm so excited about this next home. You know, out of all the homes that we've seen today, this is both me and Amanda's favorite. It has so many cool and unique features. In fact, we are inspired. Our next home is gonna be built just like this one. Can't wait to show you inside. Hey guys, it's Michael Soldano with the Amanda Vang team. I have a gorgeous new construction home to show you today. This is the Plaza at Gateway Plan 2 by Pulte Homes. Three bedrooms, three full bathrooms, a two car garage, 1791 square feet. Some of the major features, it is walking distance to Santana Row. It has a really intuitive and smart design, smartly designed floor plan. Can't wait to show you inside. All right, so first we have this foyer area. I like that they've painted this as an accent wall. Amanda calls this a mocha color. Very unique, not something you would see very commonly, but once we get to the main floor, it fits in perfectly with everything. I love this feature too. Instead of just a normal coat closet, you have an extended coat closet, so plenty of room for not just your coats, but storage as well. Let's take a look upstairs. All right, here we are on the main floor and get ready to be amazed. Look at how beautiful this home is. We've got the whites, the browns, the brushed gold. It's like me and Amanda's all of our favorite colors. I even love that they snuck some black in here. Look at this, we've got the frameless cabinets. It's like a standard shaker design, but they've used these small round black handles. What a, what a statement, I love it. Not only that, look at this quartz. This quartz is called like a desert rose or a desert smoke. This is one of my favorites. Now, you might look at this in the design center and say it looks kind of weird, but you look at it in a home like this one where you've got the browns, the very warm tones, and it just fits perfectly. I love it so much. I like the flooring too. It looks like a wood flooring with wide planks. So it gives you the feeling of room. It makes you feel very roomy, but it's also very warm. A very neutral color as well. It goes perfect with the staging. Look at this gorgeous dining room. First, obviously, this light fixture. Yeah, I <laughs> just love it. This table looks like it was carved out of a big piece of wood. I can see the plank, that's okay. But you see how you've got this interplay of the wood, the floors, the golden colors, the lights and the darks, it's gorgeous. Even you have an accent wall here, a mirror to give you some extra space. Over here, you've got a beautiful balcony where you can enjoy your morning coffee, whatever you need. Very, very nice. I love in the kitchen, they've also got the waterfall here, so you can get a little more of that desert smoke or the desert rose. Oh man, what a cool, cool design for the countertop. Even the sink, I love this material. It's like a matte material, so it's not the shiny porcelain, it's a matte sink. Wow, very cool. No detail was spared in this house. Even look at this. They have the elongated subway tiles. Oh, this is like a new trend. I like this. It's very clean, very nice, very elegant. Over here, we've got the living room. Once again, we have an accent wall on the right side. You can see the interplay between the white, the wood, some dark colors. You have these big windows to bring in a lot of natural light. Uh, I love this cabinet here and this light fixture. That's a really cool light fish. I really like that. It's even got the brushed gold, translucent. Oh man, so cool. Now, let me show you something. So this is gonna be a unique part of the floor plan, but there is a full bedroom on this floor. Look at how gorgeous this room is. You see, the colors are so neutral. They even snuck in a little bit of pink. You've got a picture frame window right here, so you can't open it, but you get extra light. It's a big, tall window. One window over here, this one does open, very nice. I like that they painted the accent wall a very neutral color. It's almost kind of like a, a brown or a khaki, but very nice, it gives the room a lot of character. A very roomy closet. The first thing I thought was I would love to have this room as my office. So you can shut the door, do your teleconferences. Someone else can be out here doing whatever they need to do. Plus you've got a full bathroom for just in case you get up late and you hit your first meeting and you need a shower between the next meeting. You know, you, I'm just saying, I'm not pointing any fingers here, but look at how gorgeous the tile in the shower is. This is one of my favorite kinds of tile. It's like a hand-formed tile. Every tile is different. 
Every tile has a unique texture. I like that they did a stacked pattern. Um, oh gosh, I could just keep going. Not only that, the, bat the countertop has an extra edge thickness. So this is a separate cutter. I'm not sure how they did it, but it's very elegant. Really, really nice. This house has so many really unique, really cool features. Love it. You know, not only that, we've got extra storage right here and a small coat closet over here. Wow, so cool. Let's take a look upstairs. Oh wait, not only do they have stairs upstairs, but look at this Amanda pointed this out. They opened up this area. So instead of having kind of a cavern or a cave, you've got this opening. It's almost like a mezzanine. You could put something here. I don't know. I think it helps with the lighting. It's just really nice. All right, here we are on the top level. I love once you get to the top of the stairs, you've got these two tall picture frame windows to bring in a lot of natural light. You've also got a cabinet over here. This is a pretty big cabinet. You fit a lot of storage in there. Perfect placement, very usable. Put some books on the top, very nice. Let's take a look at the primary bedroom. Now, one thing I love about this floor plan is that the bedrooms are huge. Like, look at how big this, this is a full king-sized bed right here. You've got this gorgeous chandelier thing is out of control, I love it. But you see how wide this nightstand is. You could easily put a desk, put a couple chairs here or there. You've got these two big windows this kind of a cabinet and a TV, just perfect. Like this is the biggest, biggest primary bedroom I've seen in a while. Not only that, you have a huge walk-in closet. It has a tall ceiling for all of the extra storage that you need. Wow, I, I mean, even look at this wallpaper. It's like a, like a twill or something like a texture. Oh, wow, this is really nice. I like it, like, <laughs> so cool. Look at this bathroom, his and hers sinks, two separated sinks, so they didn't need to do a dual sink. Sometimes you can bump elbows, but look at how much room each person has. So great. You have a private toilet facility in the middle, very roomy, not the minimum width, but extra width. Very nice. Look at this shower. Now, obviously you're gonna wanna frost that window. I mean, you can leave it, but I love how the window is a little bit lower than most windows. You can get a little bit of that sunlight on your body and enjoy the heat. It has a bench as well. The stack tile, very nice. This is a huge bathroom too, like, wow. I love it, I love it. It's, it's the way this house was designed, very unique. You don't see a lot of houses like this one nowadays, but here it is. All right, let's go take a look at the other bedrooms. Actually, first we have a laundry room over here. And once again, extra room, very big. You've got your laundry machines, plenty of room for cabinets. You could hang some shelves. You could do something with that wall. Wow, really nice use of space. This would be the third and final bedroom. Sometimes the third bedroom, the extra bedroom is smaller. Not with this house. Look how big this room is. This is. I think probably a full size bed, but you can see you've got enough room for a dresser over here. You've got a big window over here. Uh, this accent wall is gorgeous. Um, picture frame, a tall picture frame window right here and an ensuite bathroom. So looking at the bathroom, once again, nothing was spared. You've got that thick countertop, a nice oval cut sink, really elegant mirror, very nice shower space. Wow, what, what an amazing home. I must say, I am, me and Amanda, we are truly inspired by this home. I hope you guys love it too. All right guys, thanks for staying tuned until the end. I hope you love this home as much as we did. Me and Amanda are truly inspired. I mean, just look at all of these colors, look at everything, so gorgeous. So if you like this home, if you're thinking about buying a new home, whether it's new construction like this one or a resale home, don't be afraid. Call Amanda today. Her contact information is below. Until next time, this is Michael Soldana signing out. Bye, guys.